a state floodplain manager based in Madison, Wisconsin, so a short drive away. Uh, and our members across the nation, we enthusiastically support the new executive order and the flood risk management standard. We're pleased that the administration has taken a flexible approach to allow not one, but three ways to meet the new management standard. Similarly, we're pleased to see that all of the approaches uh, build in the ability to use best available climate science as data and methods will approve over time. If the executive order does apply to new construction, the management standard not only ensures buildings will be more resilient, but flood insurance will be significantly reduced. We've calculated that the standard compliant buildings will recoup additional construction costs and flood insurance savings alone in as little as one year. And for people that are financing those compliance standards, their monthly mortgage payment plus flood insurance will be cheaper than if they build to the current standard right now. Finally, this isn't so much as a, uh, as a radical kind of proposal, rather it's the federal government catching up with the rest of the nation. ASFPM uh, has used some data sets available to show that uh, at least 60% of the population of the nation lives in a community with freeboard, which is higher than the current federal standard under EO 11988. And finally, even here in Ames, Iowa, the standard is higher than what is proposed under the federal flood risk management standard and judging at least by driving through, um, Ames is doing quite well uh, economically. So again, ASFPM does support this standard and uh, we congratulate the uh, administration for this. Thank you. Thank you.